Hey everyone, welcome back to The Hidden Brick, where today we're doing part two of the build of the LEGO City Mountain Police Headquarters. If you missed part one, check it out. I'll have a link down below. This is everything we did in part one. So we basically have all of our accessory buildings, all of the minifigures, the vehicles, all the little fun play stuff, including this guy. So check it out. We're really not gonna go into it too much on this video because we have a mountain police headquarters building to build so we are moving on to our third instruction book this is third of five and we have three more bags of parts to go so we have a lot of building to go um, so we're going to begin with bag number four a lot of cool bricks in here this is uh this is getting into the fun part this is what i want the the minifigures are are cool the vehicles are also uh, required, I guess, for a city set, but I like the buildings and the big structures, so this is going to be the fun part. Now, another thing that I really was looking forward to with this set is this guy. So let's see. Open this up. What do we have here? Look at this big cat. How cool is this? Now I do have the other cats. I have the, the Black Panther, I have the, the Leopard, and the, the uh, I guess, uh, Tiger. And then this is another Tiger to add to the collection. So I absolutely love the shape, the molding, the tail, everything is really cool about this. This cat as well as all the others the molds are all the same for them it's just the, the color of the plastic and or any decoration that is printed on them so that is really cool i'm super happy to add that to my animal collection all right so i'm going to move this camera just a bit we have some large building to make so in the beginning in the last video there was a bag of unnumbered an unnumbered bag that had large parts in it. So we're gonna pull this big 16 by 16 plate that was from that bag. Um, put that other plate next to it. Let's see, find a sloped piece, here it is. We have these yellow bricks with Technic pins on the side. Here we have this tile with a bar piece. And we're gonna put tiles all the way down to there. And we have four of these double wide baby bow shapes. So it looks like we're creating a driveway of some sort. that another little stop piece and some more of our yellow parts next up where is it at so i'm looking for a brick there need the plate with the studs on only two sides. Where is it at? Nope. You know what? It might still be in the bag. Nope. That's a that. Huh. Oh, there it is. It was right in front of my face. I hate when that happens. Looking for something and it's right there and you just can't see it. Okay, so we have this droid head piece and then a telescoping piece, tile, tall brick, Move 
this a little bit to the side. We have another one of our plates that was in the big unnumbered bag. Tile and a red plate. Another tall brick and another tile. Here's a door frame. We're gonna put a solid gray door in the frame with this dark gray stud for the door, door handle. And here we have a warning sign. It says keep out. Looks like it has a picture of a angry cat with some crossbones basically saying this guy is dangerous okay another tall brick here and another one here so the tall bricks really help build up the structure pretty quick. Another large plate. And some more tiles. Do one, two, and three. These tiles will help hold everything together. A couple slopes. feature here we have a Technic axle with a stop it goes inside there and then we have this little ball piece that goes on the end so it kind of acts as a little plunger element two more tiles right here and we have three of these tall bricks one two three Regular brick, we're gonna do a two Technic bricks, another brick like that. That goes there. There's two plates on top will help hold it together now. This piece also came in our big unnumbered bag of parts. So this guy will go right here on the corner. And we have another regular brick right here. So this is, remember this is the mountain police headquarters. So this is part of the natural mountain landscape right here. Or at least that's what you can imagine. Piece. We'll go there. Regular brick here. Have a large slope and a slightly smaller slope right there. there and another big rock piece pop that guy there we have a couple greenery pieces let's go there this and this there and there One, two, 
one and two pieces there. single red plate on it. I'll go there. Next is brick going there. A few more plates. I'll go there. A brown ladder piece. Let's go on up here. <clears throat> Something's not right. Fits like that, but it shows it one stud over. Hmm. <laughs> I will have to figure out how to fix that because that's not right. I made a mistake somewhere. But we'll. This piece here, this piece here, this one will go there. Let me back up a few steps. How is that not. Okay, I see. And this piece should be right there, right there, right there, right there. Okay, we're all good now. So there's our ladder going up. And that completes bag number four. It also completes instruction book number three. So let's move on to our fourth instruction book right now and our fifth bag of parts. Okay, here we go. We have everything out, ready to go. Just gonna keep on building on. I'm pretty sure we're done with all the minifigures for this set. There's our columns there. Let's see, we have a brick piece here and a tall brick here. Another one of our big rock pieces. Put a plate there. Dropping stuff. I've been known to do that in my videos before. So if you're new to this channel, first I want to say thanks for watching, but if you're not new, you may know that I drop a lot of stuff. Okay, that piece, have a small sloped piece right here. This instruction book is pretty big and it's pretty crazy when you just have one or two little parts per step. Right, so here's a little, looks like we're making the jail cell. There's a little bed, there's a little sink here. Where does this go? Okay, it goes over that top. We have a sticker. This is sticker number eight, which looks like a little picture of a fish. Looks like a piranha. No, oh, I don't know if you noticed that. The fish actually has a striped jail uniform on as well. All right, that looks good. Brick going across. 
across to there, a sloped piece here. yellow cheese slope represents a light it's there here's our jail cell door little door handle that'll go there <clears throat> now we have the corner door frame. And this is just going to get the bars. Go there. Plate. here and two more slopes that goes there. <clears throat> now we have a plate. Help lock that in place. Another plate there. Brick. Here we have five brackets going all the way across the front just like that I'm do two of these trans orange tiles and then a one by six tile there technic brick going all the way across there Brick has some friction pins. This little piece here. <clears throat> that one over there. Corner Technic Brick. And we're going to put <clears throat> these Technic pins in here. Hold everything together. Come on, get in there. There it goes. Sometimes you have to wiggle the bricks to make sure everything lines up. And then on this side, we're going to put these long lift arms and this will help hold our little tower structure together all right so that's all good nothing's falling off there a couple plates there <clears throat> this plate we're going to do two smaller plates, a grill tile, the two plates with clips, and then a bar across the top. Our next 
next little ladder piece. Looks like I got that one lined up just fine. Struggled with the bottom one. Two inverted slopes and some palisade bricks in between them. goes there. Let's see. Some grill tiles. Plate there. So this looks like we're going to make a security camera. This will clip on right there. It's pretty close to uh, the door. But I guess it'll work. And we have these large plates that were loose or that came in the first when we opened the box. It had some unnumbered bag of large parts. So those go there. And then this yellow clip wall is gonna have some accessories on it. Looks like we have a little flashlight and some handcuffs like that. And there you go. That completes bag four. I mean, the instruction book four completes bag number five. So we are moving on to our fifth instruction book and our final bag, bag number six right now. Okay. We have everything out, ready to go. Jump right into it. We're not going to mess around. We have a tall one by one brick. Plate, palisade brick, another tall one by one, two by four, and we're going to make a little accessory piece. It's a little coffee, coffee machine. So of course you have your standard Lego City issued coffee mug. under here that'll go there I'll go there is that your little coffee maker which will go right there black plate there's a black ingot piece on the top, if I can find it amongst all of the parts. Oh, this also gets a, um, a sticker. This is a fish tank. Oh, this is the piranha. Remember that picture we looked at in the jail cell? Here's that they have captured it as well, put it in a jail cell uniform, and it's in a locked up fish tank. Interesting. All right. Sticker, sticker number two. Appears to be some sort of radio device. Whoops, dropping stuff again. reddish brown skeleton legs. I'll we'll put a little microphone on there. So that looks like our little CB radio. Goes 
there. Do palisade brick and all one by there. All right, we have our corner frame piece. So get a trans light blue door. Sticker number 11. Simply says police. In case you didn't know where you were, you're at the police station. So it shows the model turned this way so we can continue building everything for the walls. Another sticker, sticker number 12. Calendar. All right, another little desk. Here's our standard coffee mug and a pretty standard detail here of the computer screen. Um, if I can find it, it's black. There it is, it's hiding under some pieces. So there's that piece. And we'll go up there. Like I said, standard issued stuff. Nothing that's new. Two chairs go there. Next up, we're gonna make the windows, and there's gonna be four of them. They're gonna be identical. So it starts with the blue glass. We're gonna put it on a plate, palisade brick, and another plate on top. all four of them. Pick those guys up. So basically going to go in each one of these little openings that we have. Just like that. That white brick go across there. Last one right here goes there. All right, so here we have plate, we have a tile, a one by one tile, corner tile. One by one tile. So all of this is gonna lock all those windows in place. A corner tile there. Move 
that to the side for a second. We have a little sub assembly to make. sloped roof pieces we'll both go here and then our light gray minifigure stands collectible minifigure stands I like that they starting to use those in sets instead of just making them part of the collectible minifigure sets all right so it looks like this go just like that create the roof portion of the um, police headquarters so here we have our communications satellite dish top this clips on just like that so that is what's up there we have a tile with police sticker on it I probably have a handful of these tiles just over the years with all the police stations that they come out with just generic police sticker so here we have tile, two reddish brown arches, another tile, and a turntable plate. Here's our net shooter. Just kind of a gimmick play feature if you ask me because why would they just have a net shooter just sitting around on top of a police station? All right, so there's that little assembly and then here's our net shooter piece. This is going to get um, a couple stickers side just says caution on both sides and then our little plunger piece that goes in there and you can see it's got the technic pin holes on the bottom and then we got our two technic pins there so that's what it basically connects to simply like that and then that goes there so there's our little gimmick play feature um, we're going to build some safety railing across here bar piece that goes there some more of these little reddish brown skeleton legs they make great little railing pieces I've used the, the black ones before in my own creations as little railing parts all right so we're gonna do the longer bars there and there Two shorter bars, one there, and one right there. 
Next is a Technic piece. We're almost done with this set. there. This snaps on right down there. That's our little piece that opens and closes. And last little part. And wouldn't you believe it, the last step of the set uses our last sticker. So it's last sticker time. Whoops. up with that so here's a little net for the net shooter if you're so inclined to play with it you basically pull that back which basically triggers it you shove the net in there the best you can and then you shoot it out there's absolutely no accuracy to it or any type of um, gauge of distance you just have to imagine that it Um, get those guys and then our, um, our little big cat goes in there and then the, the play feature with that let me pull this down so remember we have that little plunger piece back there see right there you can push him and then he runs out of there so imagine your little crazy guy here trying to sneak up on the police station because, uh, you know, no one could tell that he's wearing a log, but the big cat sees him and then comes out and attacks him. All right. So, like I said, that completes the build of the set. The other little play feature is the, um, the bad guy helicopter has this little grappling hook. I can hook on to the top there and yank the side of the wall off to allow the prisoner to escape. So, good stuff here. We move the box out of the way. We'll check out everything. So we have our big police station. We have the helicopter with the helipad. <clears throat> we have a motorcycle cop, or I guess dirt bike style cop. You also have the big four by four style um, police truck. Move this a little bit more. There we go. It's actually pretty big once you combine everything. And then of course you've got the gold hidden in the the mountainside right there this part opens up and you can park your 4x4 truck in there perfectly if it's nicely in there then it can come out and then we have all of our minifigures we have the police guy there that guy here's the bad guy that's supposed to be in the the jail cell and yeah that's all we have the, pilot there and then there's a pilot in that one as well so very good all right appreciate you guys watching if you love this video and you want to see more just like it then check out the links i have down below i have tons of lego build videos i have a tons of lego city vid videos so if you love lego city you're in the right spot if you love lego in general you're also in the right spot so check out all the links i have down below make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any new videos that i publish and we will see you in the future